Hey guys, Shock here from Socky. Check it in today's video. I'm going to show you guys an insane effect you can activate on any Samsung Galaxy smartphone. So let's dive in and get started right away. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So I'm going to go to my lock screen and you can see here I have my lock screen. I'm going to log in with my fingerprint and as I log in, I'm going to get this beautiful edge lighting effect just for logging in and I can customize that effect, including its duration, and I can apply that effect to other amazing areas that I'm gonna show you how to set up. So again, let me show that to you, and then I'll show you guys how to set it up. Even if I'm in the always on display, and if I log in, look at that, that beautiful effect that shows up, making my phone much more fun. So what you wanna do to activate this effect, simply for unlocking your phone with your fingerprint, is you go to the settings, all right? You scroll down and go to modes and routines. You tap on it, and then you go to the routines area right here, and you can see I have it set up right here, but let me show you how to actually do it again. So I'm gonna delete this so we can do step-by-step step from the beginning. So tap on, go to routines, tap on plus, and then choose if, tap on if, and then scroll down and look for unlock with fingerprint. Okay, so it's gonna be right here. So use this, unlock with fingerprint, and then choose which fingerprint you want to use. You can see I have the left index and fingerprint two. That's my thumb. This is my index, so I'm gonna use this one for this video. I'm gonna tap on done, and then what you wanna do is you wanna to go to then. If I unlock with fingerprint, then tap over here and go for the effects right here, okay? Go to effects and choose edge lighting effect once. So tap on this guy, and from here you can choose which one you want to use. So that was the glitter effect, then you have the echo effect as you can see. It's all gonna be up to you which one you wanna use. Let's do the basic in this instance, and choose a color of your choice. Let's do green, and go to advanced, and change the width to a little thicker so you can see it better. And the duration can be uh, long, or short, it's up to you. Let's do medium. Now tap on done, and then tap on save, and give your effect a name. You can even pick some colors and pick some icons, whatever, that's up to you. Okay, let's do this one, tap on done. Now that is saved, look at this. If I go to my lock screen, and just unlock it with my fingerprint, I get that precise effect that I chose. Now let's take this one step further. You can do the same thing with app launches. So let's go back into modes and routines right over here. Okay, I'm gonna say go to routines, I'm gonna tap on plus, and then I'm gonna say if I launch an application. So that's gonna be right here at the bottom, towards the bottom, app opened. So let's say I'm gonna launch the music application. I want some nice effects to go with it. Uh, let's see if I have the music application. I don't, so we're just gonna use the My Files as an example, okay? So I'm gonna tap over here, I'm gonna tap on Done. So if I launch My Files application, then I want to add an effect. So look at this, tap on Effects, go to Edge Lighting Effect once, and I can choose anything I want. Again, choose a color that you want. Let's do red for this one, tap on Done, and tap on Save, give it a name, tap on Done and you're good to go, it's right here. Now let me just turn on the dark mode so you can see this better. So I'm gonna turn on the dark mode, and now we're gonna to go to My Files, right over here. I'm gonna launch the application, and boom, you can see we have that effect in the background, okay? Now that was a very thin effect, so if I were to go back over here, I can customize it, okay? So look at this, if I choose the effect and go to Advanced, I can make it wide, as you can see. And let's pick the color red again. It's gonna look like this this time. Now I just overwrote that by editing it, so that's the new parameters are saved. So now when I go to My Files application or any application of your choosing, boom, it's gonna be thicker, as you can see, more pronounced, much cooler. You can do this basically with anything that you want using the modes and routines option under the settings. All right, guys, fantastic. Any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below.